What's up YouTube, Spicicast here. Today a special Mardi Gras video courtesy of Cindy and Michael. Huge thank you to Cindy and Michael for sending me this delicious king cake from Julianne's Bakery. Link will be in the description to the bakery's website. So just a quick background, Mardi Gras is a very festive time, namely in Louisiana, and they throw parties and everything. Everybody, it's all crazy and whatnot. So this is what a king cake looks like. It looks like a great giant glazed donut. So not all bakeries do this anymore, but some still put a small plastic baby inside of the cake. They actually bake it into the cake. And if you get a, that wedge of cake with the baby in there, it's supposed to symbolize good luck and everything, but it also puts you on the hook for the next cake or party for the following year. This one is pralines and cream cheese, or do you say pralines? I, I don't know what you guys pronounce it as, but I uh, didn't even know that they made various flavors of king cake. That's new to me. Look at this, Julianne's Bakery even sends some beads and doubloons. No, I will not flash the camera. So as I said before, Julianne's will actually bake the plastic baby into the cake. So I have absolutely no idea where this plastic baby is inside here. So I'm gonna up the stakes just a little bit. I'm gonna cut this into three slices, three little wedges. I'm gonna pick a wedge and I'm gonna eat that wedge on camera. If I get the baby, well, I'm going to be in a little bit of trouble. I'm going to have some coffee, but along with my coffee... Oh man, it's the return of Carolina Reaper Vodka. Yes, the Carolina Reaper Vodka that you saw me probably make in 2015. Yeah, there's a video on this on my channel. The link will be in the description and at the end of the video. So, pray to see if you want to see me suffer. All right, still have no idea where this plastic baby is, and if I cut into this plastic baby again, I automatically lose. So I'm gonna use this label as a way to help me cut this into thirds. So I didn't cut into the plastic baby at all, but I am going to do you guys a favor and try to pick the largest piece of this bunch. This is going to be wedge one right here up top, wedge two over here, and then wedge three over here. So I think I'm going to pick, because I can't see squat inside right now. I don't know what, where is what or where the baby might be. So I'm just going to pick wedge one right up here. How about that? That cool for you? Pick wedge number one. Man, this is a giant piece. Look at this, look how big this darn piece is right here. It really is just like a big ass glazed donut. And I can't see the baby anywhere over there, so I think I'm good for right now. I'm gonna keep this as unedited as I can, at least for this purpose. I'm gonna put this to the side so we have room. It looks delicious, it smells delicious. I'm gonna use a fork and knife so I don't, you know, crack a filling or anything, trying to bite into this darn thing. But here we go, guys. I'm gonna enjoy this. Thank you again, Cindy and Michael. All right guys, last little bit here. Let's see if I cut in this way. If I get a baby, then there it is. If not, well, I've survived. So here we go. I think I've survived. I don't see a baby anywhere. My stomach thanks me right now. Let's get some hot sauce in here for the last two bites. Yeah, how about some of this Trinidad Scorpion sauce? Adobo Loco. Shake it up. Put it on here. Let's enjoy. Oh, oh hot sauce, yeah.
Oh man, I'm gonna have sugar stroke soon. Can't believe I did all those sugar challenges in the past. That's a lot of sugar. All right, folks, I'm gonna cut into the rest of this king cake to find this plastic baby, see which wedge it was in. I'm gonna start with wedge three here. Okay, I don't think it was in wedge number three. Let's see if it was in wedge number two. Where is this plastic baby? <laughs> Seriously, where is it? Have I been deceived? I, mean, I can't I can't find squat in here. I was led to believe that there is a baby in here. But there might not be. Am I being, am I being punked here? I mean there's no way you can miss it. There's there's no way. I know I didn't eat the baby, I'm gonna tell you that much. Okay, I have searched everywhere in the rest of this king cake for that plastic baby and I can't find it. And I was led to believe all this time that there was a plastic baby baked into this cake. So maybe Julianne's also went, you know, the way of, okay, we don't want to get sued kind of a thing. And that's great and all. But this completely undermines the whole point of this video. Other than thanks Cindy and Michael. Oh my god, this is this is a this turned into a fail. On the plus side, I can now make king cake bread pudding with all of these pieces. It's disappointing and very, very depressing all at the same time that there's no plastic baby in the king cake. Well, I apologize if you got this far in the video. It was absolutely unintentional. Uh, on this. So, as punishment for all of this, I lose. So, here we go. Vodka. Small glass. And whatever coffee I've got left. So let's, let's do this first. Oh, I can already smell the Reapers. Oh, oh what the hell? Oh my god. That's good enough. Trust me on that. Trust me on that. That's good enough. I don't even know how far I'm going to go up on this. But I'll do something like that. It's still warm coffee. Oh, oh my god. Shaken, not stirred. Goodbye, upcoming weekend. <coughs> oh, shiznit. It just hits the throat pretty violently. It's gonna be there for a while. Holy cow. Bad idea. Bad, bad idea. Courtesy of the stupid panda. Couldn't down like a shot either. There's no way. So guys, if you like this video, give a thumbs up, share, subscribe, and comment below. I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, so follow me there. That's all for this special Mardi Gras video, guys. Embrace that pain, and I'll see you in the next video.